For too long I've been killed like a noob on reason to die. What happened? I used to be one of the reason to die players. I knew everything about the game. All these people are saying I need to get carried. But by who? Everyone on the beginner servers are just as terrible as me. If only there was someone who was so knowledgeable at the game, they could teach me everything I need to know. Oh, I think I might be saved. All right, so what are we doing here? What's the objective? Oh, oh uh, no! Okay. Oh no! <laughs> the first. Okay. <laughs> Okay, first thing, you don't want to die, so just don't stand next to the Yeah, I think I got that. I'm like stuck down here. There, I saw like a brute near the ramp. Oh, what's up? Okay. Okay, follow me. There should be like a med kit maybe in here. Okay. I was really I scared I would have fallen and there would have been like 10 million zombies down there. So, no, I have pills. Or vitamins. Or, or, did they used to be called pills or is that like the Mandela effect? Yeah, yeah, they were called pills and then... I'm assuming Roblox, uh, Roblox was like... Yeah, Roblox no changed the rules and then here I did like immediately change it. It was, it was soda. It was called like ice cola. Or, oh no, ace cola. Oh, I, I see. Remember now. Yeah, it was called ace cola for like a day and then here I changed it to vitamins. Yeah, I need that. Wait. I'm full health. How'd I get full health? Someone probably threw you an acorn. Oh, nice. So, <laughs> there's like 10 million items in this game now. All I remember is like, when I played, there was grenade, pipe bomb, med kit. That was pretty much it. <laughs> yeah, all these basic items. Now there's a bunch that you can just give yourself in the middle of the round. You have all this utility. That's pretty cool. I noticed Start. how there was like give commands. Is that like give cake? Because I remember give cake was a... Yeah, there's a yeah, there's an actual cake item in the game, but oh nice, it just gives you oh shoot, and you can get you can give it to yourself a bunch of times. Yeah, so are, do those come after like boss events? I'm assuming the uh, items. Yeah, yeah, they come out of the bosses. There's three permanent bosses, so you can get uh, items for all three of them. Oh nice. Really cool. Is the is the clock guy one of them? I've been seeing people yeah, using the, the clock pipe bombs or whatever. A Kronos, King Cherry Cake, and Jack Swamp. Very nice. I briefly remember when Reason to Die Awakening was in its like beta phase. They added, I, I don't quite remember what it is. It was a winter theme boss. Was it like a Yeti or something? Yeah, Yeti. It just called Yeti. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, that's like you... the last boss I remember. Did you beat it? Uh, I think so, but if you beat it, you should uh, have a badge that says you beat it, and that badge will give you the Christmas sword. I actually have it. Oh, nice. Like, like it was its own sure. game. Okay, how do I get these bees off of here? Yeah, you can't. You just have to, like... Oh, I think I'm dead here. No! Oh, no, wait. Alright, here we go. So there is a revive mechanic. You have to jump up, you have to jump up, you have to get up here. I don't think it's not going to be enough time. Alright. I'm going to use my parkour shit. skills. Okay, here we go. Oh shoot, the helicopter's right there. Bye, yeah, we're just leaving. <laughs> oh, what? You guys are leaving already? Yeah, that, yeah, oh, it was like 10 seconds left. <laughs> I totally didn't see that. You know, this that always happens. <laughs> I get to the end of the round, and like, I have no idea what's going on. Then I realize, oh, the rescue's leaving. I was taking my time trying to parkour up there. I was like, don't want to miss a jump. Yeah, yeah it's hard. <laughs> I totally wasn't paying attention to the top left. That was, that was my bad. All right. I think I have enough to buy the Mac 10, or should I save up for the, the M16A1? Mac 10 is good to get you other weapons, but if you but the M16 can carry you a lot. It depends what you want. If you want an SMG or a burst on All right. You know, I'm pretty sick of the Remington, so... I'll just use the Mac 10 right now. What do you suggest? Do you suggest the yellow vest or the red vest? Because I've heard it's the, different opinions. It's the fire vest. Fire vest? Yeah. Because it makes you uh, fireproof, so elementals can't hurt you. But when they do that explode, and then do that explode ability, it can hurt you, but it won't give you like any afterburn. Oh, nice. So, looks like I'm a zombie this round. Yeah, I'm just upgrading my zombie. So I can kill everyone. Nice. Yeah, so tell me about uh, zombie upgrades, because it's totally a new thing I 
don't know anything yeah, about. Yeah, when it came out, everyone was like, oh, cool, we got zombie upgrades now, now my zombie isn't bad, now I can actually do something. And then after like a few months, everyone realized how powerful they were. Like the <laughs> basic zombie does nearly like 30 damage to a person and you can just one shot them. Jeez, that's pretty hard to yeah, balance be... these upgrade things. Yeah, it had to be toned. Some of them got toned down, but PR didn't really yeah. do that many nerfs to it. So I've noticed how, what do you call the radioactive dudes? Tickers? Yeah, tickers. Um, I noticed some of them explode on impact. Is that part yeah, of the upgrade? Yeah, no, that's just the basic ability. You have to rush with it. You have to double tap W. Oh, nice. And you'll, you'll run in like the oh. direction facing it. No way. Yeah, but you can't like turn or anything. So yeah. It's like, yeah. Okay, that's really cool. I had no idea that existed. I noticed someone has the the straw hat and the katana. They're still in the game. No, the straw hat. I think we we're supposed to have the straw hat. No, we thought about doing it, but we didn't. Oh, we so this is just this guy's good. model. Yeah, there's there's armors that increase your stamina, so you can kind of do that. Yeah, I remember that was like a big strategy in the uh, original Reason to Die. I wonder how many rounds I'll win. Probably one for every five rounds. <laughs> and so, Unless I get carried hard enough. Well, next up should be kind of easy to... You're just beating this guy up. There he goes. Oh, hey, there's a, there's a crate right here that says Sinister Arms, Inc. Is this yeah. the is this the shipping post for your uh, YouTube content? I suppose. Yeah, the the lore stuff in this game, the company I started. Yeah, so tell me about the reason to die lore. I didn't, I had no idea there was lore. Well, it's kind of it's official but semi-official. The PR didn't really like make any uh, lore to it. The only lore you'll see is in like the maps, and the maps are like all over the place. Like Easter eggs. Yeah. But I made my own lore for it, so some of these maps kind of have that, and some of the weapons do kind of translate that. Oh, nice. A bit. That's pretty. That's pretty cool. I like it a lot. We're supposed to get a story mode, but we didn't have time to do that. And I think PR forgot about it. Oh, that would have been cool for like a single player like a campaign, maybe. It would have been kind of been like uh, like Left 4 Dead, where they have a small group of survivors and you have to go through all these levels and stuff. Yeah. Well, uh, did anyone survive? Yeah. Uh, two people. people. I'm at a rank up too. Oh, nice. What rank are you? I'm uh, rank 38. Let's go. Is, is there, yeah, prestige system, I'm assuming. Yeah, a lot of people in the game don't like the prestige because when you do it, you get uh, an HP upgrade as your survivor. Mm. You can prestige like 15 times, so your base HP at max prestige is like 300 or something. And you have to stack that with armor, so you're basically unkillable. Oh, nice. Yeah, some people think it's nice, but other people think it's like really un un yeah. uh, overpowered. And you can pre just prestige <laughs> forever? Only 15 times. 15 times. And was Prestige 15 uh, bug tested? It's not too OP. <laughs> I don't think PR really cares about what's OP and what's not OP. I see. He just, yeah, he just added like whatever. So you're telling me basically this game's gonna devolve into anarchy given like a year of it being up <laughs> without any updates. Yeah. As soon, like as soon as the majority of the player base became like high ranks, it just kind of spiraled out of control there. Nice. And I just think that a lot of people are already ranking up. <laughs> Let's go. I'm just gonna to gonna follow you because I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> so this map should be kind of familiar with some stuff. Right oh wait, is this the is this the map with the big building? And yeah, oh, I know this map. What's it called? Fox There's Coast an elevator right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we get up here. I remember. Do you remember uh, uh, gift hopping? Gift hopping? Yeah, in the original Reason to Die. Yeah, I vaguely remember that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I remember that. It's where uh, you you get your gifts from the bosses or something, and you can like continually spam them to like fly or something, like limitedly. I remember on my original gift hopping video, I think I demonstrated it on this map. Yeah, the, the nostalgia is coming back. I don't think a 13 year old me realized that I just was bringing an exploit into the game that probably should have have been discovered. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you did that in this game, you'd probably get banned by the mods. So, yeah, so I, can get up here again. I don't feel like I'm contributing anything. I'm just kind of staying here. We're just yeah. camping the <laughs> yeah, top of it. Yeah, that's everyone right now. You know that's what? This map in general. Yeah, I, I, I don't think anything's changed really. In the original reason that I, it was just like this. People just camp this top yeah, area. It's, it's just this map in particular because of the large building here. No one wants to like explore yeah. anything. Wasn't there um? Is there still that winter Easter egg? during uh, winter. Is it this map? Where there's a jukebox oh, and it plays uh, like Let It Snow? Oh yeah, it's over there. Yeah, it still plays music. Oh nice. Different music. Yeah. You can go over there and play it right now. Uh, I don't think I want to risk getting off here. <laughs> I don't have any mounts to get <laughs> back up and uh, yeah, things do not look fun down there, so. Oh yeah, they patched everything up. Like, oh, 
Oh, I totally forgot about patching. Like, you can patch and board things up. Yeah, you can build stuff with hammers now, instead of just like putting planks down. You can actually build structures nice. and stuff. So it's like Fortnite now, like do build battles? <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> it's not. It's nothing like, like absurd where you build like an entire Let's forest, go. it's just like you're building fences, and that's it. Oh, that's disappointing. It's just fence, small fence, fence with a door, and that's it. <laughs> I love to see and a build like a battle standard. between like a brute and a player. You, cool. you can kind of do that. Like, you can totally grief the zombies by doing that, but I don't think people really want to do that. Yeah. Because like, you can micromanage it right. really hard. Oh, look. Someone built a smiling oh. face. That's nice. Or is that an arrow? No, it's a smiling face. Maybe it's an arrow telling you to jump off. <laughs> oh, that's not nice. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, well, I can because I have the mount, but... Oh, yeah. Well, for me, I'm a, a mountless, so... So how yeah, would I go you... about getting my first mount? You can't get them out. There's no mounts you can get what? them right now. No way. Yeah, like all, them, all the mounts are exclusive. Like, you had to play the game during the event. Dang, so I'm going to be forever mountless. Yeah, that kind of sucks. It's unfortunate. You can still, you can still uh, use a jetpack, though. <laughs> that guy did not <laughs> like what we're doing. <laughs> it's just called the scampers. I've, I've, heard, uh, I've heard that many times on this map, though. Yeah, nothing really has changed. <laughs> He's not a pipe bomb and everything just to... <laughs> VM. <laughs> okay, campers. And we get $900. For this. Oh! Just I almost got crushed by that helicopter. I wish some funny glitches would uh, occur. Because in the original reason, I you, like, you couldn't really get in. Like, you could ju just kind of sit there. I remember there was a map. Okay. Um, I don't know if it's still in this game, but I'm going to try to describe it, right? You spawn, and there's like an island on this big lake, I think. And there's a bridge that leads to like another island. And there's like a farmhouse there. And like it's a rescue mission because a plane comes in, right? Yeah, Campfire Chaos. Campfire Chaos, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we were playing that yesterday. Oh, really? Is it yeah. just the updated version of that? Yeah, it's yeah. not It's not set at night. Ah, uh, I uh, see. Afternoon. And as like an actual jet comes in, you have to fuel it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember in the original one, the jet just came in. <laughs> and what <laughs> happened a lot of the times is you just have to sit there until the plane would take off. And so what would happen is like, at near the end of the round, people will just buy tanks and just go in the plane. Yeah. <laughs> and just, just throw rocks everywhere. everywhere. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Good times. Oh, someone just threatened Ty Senpai that they will unsub. He keeps camping. He doesn't <laughs> He doesn't really upload Reason Die videos that much anymore. So oh, really? I really think he cares. Yeah. So what's going on with the Reason Die community? Are there any, like, prominent players now? Because, I mean, I remember when I was, when I played it back in 2014, it was like, like Joe Pede, Ty Senpai, Swagger. Yeah, and then Swagger. Yeah. And then that was it. <laughs> like, no one else. That was just me and Joe Pete, and that's it. Like, oh, there, nice. There really, there really isn't, like, any competition, aside from just me and him just uploading at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> nice, yeah. You know, he has, like, like five times more of the subs than me. I still somehow kind of sometimes pull in, like, more views. Yeah, I watched a bit of your Cap and Joe Pete episode. So tell me about that series. Just, like, we just upload randomly. That's really... <laughs> oh, nice. We really easy like, a schedule to it. Is it pretty popular amongst uh, the RTD community? One of them is, and that's the one where he names like the loadout we're doing in the video as the cone loadout, and it was so stupid. Because <laughs> everyone was like, what, what is he talking about? <laughs> like, it's, like, does it, like, it doesn't <laughs> relate to anything we're doing. <laughs> he just saw something on the map, and then he's like, oh yeah, it's the cone loadout. Oh, let's go. All right, I'm going to um, Camping Central right now, up the elevator. You know what I remember? Like, so many suppressed memories are coming back to me right now. I remember there was a way you could glitch through the elevator, and, like, the elevator wasn't, like... I don't think there was, like, anything, like, tweeting in Roblox or anything, right? So nothing was really smooth. Um, and so it'd be really glitchy, and people could get, like, under it. And, like, I remember, I think there was, like, some tanks just camping under there, and you wouldn't know they were there until the elevator would go down and all of a sudden a tank would just get pushed into it. I don't think, uh, I don't know if you remember any of that, but I sure do no, have fond memories. I kind of vaguely remember that. Either on oh, Awakening or the whole game. If you could be glitched through it. Oh no! Oh no. Oh. Wait, I could be <laughs> Dude, did you see what happened? Yeah, you just fell off a bunch of stories. <laughs> oh, let's go. Yeah, I saw that brute come up. I was like, oh no, that's not good. Hey, let's go check out the jukebox. I'm gonna see what that's about. Stand next to the acorn. Where's the acorn? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Let's go. The acorn gives oh. you 100 HP. Let's go. Okay, the jukebox is in here. All right. What kind of tunes are we playing? I'm gonna play one here. Is it like 100 gex? Oh no, this is cool. Let's go. Ask PR how much he paid for this song in particular, because you only hear it in like three instances. 
there's two jukeboxes on two maps, and you and you hear it on one campaign. Oh. And he told me it was like. Is there like told me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he told me he paid like sixty bucks for it. And I'm Are like, you why serious? Would you do that? It's like a it's like a minute long. <laughs> okay. Like a minute long stream. <laughs> why would you do that? I'm getting like swarmed right now. Yeah. Hey, you need those uh, royalties. Yeah, like he <laughs> he paid like a bunch of money so you can play that three times. <laughs> Generic 50s song. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like you could pay like some starving music major like 10 bucks and they'll happily compose that basic 50s song for you to use in your game. I was gonna I was gonna see if I can commission someone to do this song uh -huh. for a King Cheese, but I found something on Audio Jungle that sounded like oh, really nice. good. Did you keep the really stuck? Did you keep the watermark in? Audio, Audio jungle. jungle. We we didn't we couldn't buy it because uh, after we found it. Yeah. I see. Okay, so this is actually some intriguing gameplay right now. We're not actually just camping stuff. Yeah, the, the gameplay gets intense, but we're not just oh! skinny run. Jeez! Minor zombies can just destroy me. Yeah, if there's two of them, you're... <laughs> you're missing. They're like a, like a ping pong. Nothing you can do. Yeah, they just toss you around. Like, there's really nothing you can do about it. Unless you have, like, a weapon to prevent them from doing that. I see. Alright, so what's our game plan here? Are we just gonna kind of... Oh! What?! Oh, no. Wait, how did he die? I don't know! What killed me? He just exploded. <laughs> what oh, that is so sad. That's unfortunate. Yeah, that's what, I, that's what I mean. I come in these non-beginner servers, I just get destroyed by brutes and He just shot. exploded for no reason. <laughs> I don't know what killed I, I think that guy had like a... He threw his club or something. Oh, I got oh, so someone. Like a, like, oh. Like he threw a grenade or something. Yeah. Something like that. Through the foot thing and see what killed you that because he's exploded out of nowhere. <laughs> right. No, that's fine. I, you know, I don't even expect to survive many rounds though. So, is there any uh, tips you would give for any beginners like me? Any secrets in this game that you would know? Uh, not really secret. I would say first of all, if you're getting hit by a zombie, have your weapon out and equip it and just like punch or kink them instead. Mm. Oh no, I think I'm a die. Oh, hello. No, I'm gonna just. Oh, someone threw a pipe bomb. They saved you, but I'm gonna just, <laughs> I'm gonna just fly back up here. If I can get nice. up there. No, I don't. 2014 me would use gift hopping to get up there. There's no more gift hopping or rainbow jumps. I know. It, it, that was a Roblox glitch. That wasn't even a PR glitch or a reason to die glitch. Surprise! Surprisingly, it was not PR's fault. No. I remember I found it on. There was a map. It was like a top of a building, and I think like a helicopter came in. Do you know what I'm talking about? Uh, it's like, so, like, like half the maps in the old reason. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. But I remember I had my flamethrower out, and I just spammed my flamethrower in my secondary. I think it was a chainsaw or something, and I just started flying. And I was like, what? <laughs> and so, uh, Yeah, that too, <laughs> with the flamethrower. Yeah, I employed some scientific theory and did some hypothesis testing and figured out I could repeat that, so. Then came my, uh, gift hopping slash weapon hopping video, and I think after that, the community probably had a had a secret disdain towards me <laughs> <laughs> how do you open up the in-game shop press tab and go to shop tab go to shop oh nice okay that'll be really the... useful for future reference all right so what's going on in uh this map it's just uh, a cartoony looking town this is very survived for two minutes very colorful kind of looks like toontown I, I like this a lot i don't know why people don't like it i think it's because you don't really get that much money for beating it. I mean, I don't think there's oh, not, not even a reward for beating this. Yeah. Um, I remember I played like two days ago. I think the same thing happened to me with the helicopter that happened earlier. The helicopter was leaving, but like I didn't know how to get in. <laughs> so, so you just jumped on it? Yeah, I just jumped on it and <laughs> I started flying away. with it. Because I was like, you know, in the old reason it died, that'd work, right? You, you jump yeah. on it and you win. And apparently it didn't. And that kind of yeah, made me sad. The... <laughs> yeah, you have to now actually like get inside of it. Yeah. All right. Oh, wait a minute. I just remembered I'm a moderator. This game, I can just use the music command to play music. Oh, nice. You put on, let me scare everyone real quick. <laughs> what are you gonna play? I'm gonna, I'm gonna play the, the champion music, and every time I do it, people freak out. <laughs> like, I think the champion oh. music. Oh, shoot. I'm getting totally destroyed right here. I threw a pipe bomb. Hopefully, that deters them. It's just like a basic survival map, huh? Just wait until. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Tai Senpai. Tai Senpai is being so nice right now, just giving me all these acorns. Yeah, I'm pretty sure everyone who's like a Mac PC has this huge surplus of event items. Like, like they're in the thousands. <laughs> Jesus. 
So what was there yeah, like I a have... was there like a squirrel boss or something? No, that came out of the Christmas event or oh. all the Christmas events. It's always on sale. Oh, I see. And so what's a uh, placer builder's justification for uh, Acorn to Christmas? <laughs> Jesus, I just got blown up. I don't know. It's just throw it down and it heals everyone that's near you. 100 nice. HP. And you're like, yeah, that's pretty balanced. You can add that to the gift command and you can get unlimited amounts of them. Okay, how do I use this ammo? Just... You have to press R. R. It's like, it's like oh, a... Oh, I see. Nice. You just get it okay. before you die. Yeah. Here. I need like an escort right here. I feel like that radiation is going to kill me. Okay, I'm let's just go. Run, just run in it. Oh no! You can get out of it? <laughs> yeah, I don't... Yeah, I don't press F again. <laughs> I was spam clicking. I was like, I just got to get in. <laughs> All right, we're good. Yeah, we just stand in here for 30 seconds and we win. Nice. Nothing. There's just no reward for beating <laughs> There's no reward? No, there's no reward. What? What's the point of this? I think there this? was. Well, before rescue was broken, like if you play rescue, it would just be like unlimited struggle. So they fixed it, but when Joe Pete fixed it, instead of it making them like at the reward and it lasts longer, and now it's just like three minutes, there's no reward for it. I see. So it's kind of unfortunate because this map is pretty cool into yeah. the later round like later into the game yeah and we win let's go that's pretty fun i'm one step Three closer minutes spawn camping <laughs> <laughs> right i i barely made it out i had 12 health someone had to defib me oh yeah and i'm dead on the windsor there i go yeah so i noticed how now there's a lot more like upgrades you can uh get for your things so on like two slots for catchments i wanted to like, like extend it out, or like flesh out, so you can put on more attachments and stuff. Mm. But we never got to do that. Like I don't, like I don't think we ever finished that idea that we had. I see. Room. So how long was the list of ideas? Uh, what do you mean? Like that was just weren't added in. Like a huge, <laughs> like a huge list. <laughs> like I, like I open our Trello when PR discontinued, like you press to be like discontinue the game, and everyone saw it, and they were really, I would say, some people were upset because some of the stuff was really cool, and we didn't reveal it yet because we were done with it. But they're like, yeah, why didn't we get this? Like some stuff was supposed to come in, like they were confirmed by PR Jopi, but we never got them. Ah, the I see. So they were pretty upset about that. And some stuff was like really, <laughs> I would say probably not the best idea ever for the game. <laughs> like one of the ideas was a weapon called like a chainsaw. It was like oh, an LMG, it? but had like a chainsaw grip on it. Oh, I see. So it was like a so, bayonet, <laughs> but... Yeah, just, but it's, yeah. <laughs> it's like a really weird weapon like that. <laughs> well, maybe we're thankful that some items didn't make it in. <laughs> yeah, like the chainsaw. <laughs> yeah. Would you say that reason to die is in a pretty, pretty good place right now? Uh, no. I, I'm, no. I would not be about push but no. Mm. I would say no. I mean, like, weapons like the mini gun got over tuned, even though I kind of bounced it that way. Yeah. I didn't really think it'd be that much of a problem. Because I remember the mini gun in Reason to Die, you couldn't reload it, right? Is that still a mechanic? Yeah, you can't reload it, but there's an attachment on there called the mini mini gun, where oh. like, it shortens the barrel. It gives you more damage, but it reduces your, I think, accuracy and range. Ah, I see. But you can walk normally with it, and you can sprint and all that, and you can reload it too. Oh, nice. Yeah, so I can imagine that's pretty, uh... Yeah, so it's like a, it's like a major upgrade to it, because you get like a faster rep time and everything, you can reload it. Nice. More damage. Yeah, there's like a lot of stuff going on with it. So I noticed the, the China Lake is still in the game. Is it still called that? Yeah. Nice. I remember that was a pretty cool item. But on this one, I made like an actual China Lake. Oh, nice. And I made it, yeah. So it started as like a concept at first that I put on the wiki. And everyone liked it. Like, it became, I think I think it became the most like kudoed suggestion on the wiki. Like, so many people liked it. That's and cool. PR added it, but well, he confirmed it. We remade the model because the original model for it was like a, like it just looked like a block and had like a cylinder on it. Yeah, oh, I see. Then I uh, had someone else make a better model for it and it looked like actually like realistic China Lake. Oh, nice. And it was that, that I think the same day PR saw it and he was like, yeah, we're adding this. Because <laughs> he saw the model for it, he was like, yeah, that's like really high quality model. <laughs> nice. Yeah. And it was pretty, it was really good when it came out. And then people found out that it could just be spammed to shoot yeah. on. Yeah. Certain maps. Like there's one map where there's a spawn inside of it, and it was like in a shed, right? So they called it shed farming. Oh. You couldn't get out of there because the spawns correlated to where the survivors were on the map. Uh -huh. So they were also like 
went over there to the shed and they couldn't get out of that I, I have heard of shed farming. While coming back, I've seen like a few like reason to die videos or something. I remember people talking about shed farming. Wasn't that a pretty infamous tactic? Yeah, that was a huge thing for a few months. Yeah. PR didn't, I think at the time, PR didn't update the game at all for like the entirety of spring and summer. I oh. Think. So people were just able to abuse that. Yeah, so that's how so many people are max right now because they just kept on doing that the entire Let's summer. See. And then Jeez. he he did fix it eventually, but it was kind of like too late, I'd say. Because the game was already kind of done. Yeah. And then people were blaming me and the uh, team that worked on it for making the China Lake, even though the China Lake was just a tool for that problem. And they're like, yeah, they ruined the game. Because at the time, they were like, yeah, the game's shit now. They ruined the game. Oh, like, really? The it's pretty bad now. Yeah. They were really <laughs> upset about that. It was not It was not fun. Yeah, yeah I can imagine. I can imagine how uh, that could really be damaging to the economy, I guess. Yeah, the reason, the non-existent reason to economy. <laughs> <laughs> right. You don't want to inflate your uh, your your bow bucks. I mean, it was already it was already inflated because Paris didn't like adjust the currency mm. for the new weapons. So it so before you could buy uh, money with Robux, but the rate for the Robux and money exchange it was like from when the game was in demo. Like when it was in demo, like you'd see this and you'd be like, oh yeah, that's a good investment. But then you see it now and you're like, oh, I can just get that much money. Right. So way. people wouldn't care to buy. Yeah, so cash, it huh? really. Yeah, we try to fix it up here. It's like, no, we're not going to fix it. I see. Oh, like, they did find a solution for it, but it was like yeah. so really complex. It was for no reason, so we never had it. Right. And then he made money. He made uh, getting money a lot easier with the campaign bonus stuff. So. Right. And the bounties. Did he still do the uh, early access with Robux on weapons? He did that with the fire axe, but that was the only weapon he did it with. Oh, really? For the entirety of Reason to Die Awakening? Yeah, it was only the fire wow. axe, I'm pretty sure. It was because the fire axe was the first melee in the game at the time. So people were like, oh, yeah, a great fire axe melee you can get with Robux. And it gave you like melee immunity and all that. So like, if a zombie tried to hit you while you were using it, it wouldn't work. Oh, nice. So, yeah, it was, pre it was really useful. And then. Melee's kind of like really dipped down in usefulness. Yeah. When new secondaries came out. Yeah. I remember um, the last time I got one of those early access weapons was the uh, bazooka. Um, which, what, what happened to the bazooka? I totally uh, <laughs> never really added it. I think he just turned it into the RPG. Totally lost my uh, my Robux worth of uh, bazookas. So. <laughs> yeah, he should probably turn that. Probably should have made it so if you bought that, you yeah, probably got Placer that. Builder, I'm looking at you for my uh, 200 Robux compensation. <laughs> I expect he to see it. He did put some weapons on sale. Like the... He put like a bunch of weapons on sale for Christmas. Like the bread, the Peacemakers, like all these other weapons. Oh, nice. All these high-ranked weapons, so... Including the RPG, so... <laughs> you buy it again, I guess. <laughs> right. But I think it's like, it costs a lot more, too. <laughs> Dang. Unfortunate. Well, let's go. Yeah, let's so does everyone escape, or is it people in the, in the truck? Yeah, you have to get in the cave. Mm. Nice. Oh, and I ranked up as <laughs> we were winning. Let's <laughs> got go. More wow. Yo, MVP. That's awesome. Yeah. Only take up in this server. I like the um, escape music. That's really cool. How much uh, did Placer Builder have loud. to <laughs> have to pay for that? <laughs> Probably another sixty dollars for that ten-second tune. Let's go. I would say. Do you think? I told him he needs to turn it down because <laughs> so because a lot of people complain how it's sold out. Like you can't mute it. If like you have your music muted, you, you'll still play. And he told me it's perfect the way it is. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> what are you talking about? Like it literally like explode in your your headphones. Yeah, let's <laughs> destroy a fan base's ears. Yeah, like, like, make sure that they know that they survived by just ear raping yeah, them. Maybe, maybe Place of Builder was actually trying to, <laughs> to destroy his own ears so he couldn't hear the, all the complaints about <laughs> the game, right? Yeah, that's probably most likely what happened. Next time on Getting Carried by Cap. Champion into the... Oh! Oh no, wait, he can't get in there. <laughs> He's good! Yeah. Alright. Oh no, wait, he can't get in there! <laughs> wait, no, 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 I don't want Oh! Yeah, he's going fire or just oh, like. Nice. Uh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I can't make it. Did you make it? <laughs> yeah, I made it. Yes. <laughs> Let's wow. go.